Yo guys, welcome back to another video, and the other day there was an update for New Speed Payback, it includes some new cars, Vicetti Skyline, and some other stuff including new races. Now, a new race up here is called the Titanium Trials Damson, it's the Castrol Titanium Trials. Also, when recording this, the new abandoned car has just came out like an hour or two ago, but it doesn't tell you where, so it could be anywhere on the map. I'm not driving on every road to find that car. Like, bit of a daft idea, really. But yeah, we're gonna do some of these titanium trials and have a look at what they're like because you do use a Castrol Audi R8. V10 Plus as well. So here we are, arrived at the titanium trials. It's called Damson. So let's get into this and see what it's really like. Hit a speed of 140 miles an hour and finish four time runs out. I'm gonna accept that, you know. I reckon we can do that. Castro invites you to three new time trials in Fortune Valley. Show who's the most skilled driver behind the wheels of Castro customised cars. So we've got Castro liveries on. It's great advertising that really. Fair dues. Gotta get some Castro oil now. Right, we're in this Audi R8 V10 Plus. How quick is it? Oh, let's keep going. <laughs> I'm about to go straight on. Accidental gear change there. Oh, I'm just drifting this. This car seems really wide for these roads. I don't know what it is. Reach the finish line in time. Okay. Yo, these events are actually quite cool. Quite like it. Quite like it's Audi as well. Handles quite well. Still got to hit 140 miles an hour. I need a straight bit of road for that. It's not going to happen up here, is it? Too twisty the roads. Oh, I could have hit 140 then if I had to crash. It was so close, but we just I just had to crash, didn't I? Here we go, here we go. This is it, 140, it's got to be. Yes, there you go, completed it. I'll do love all these fireworks. Getting some drifting going on now, really. Right, we're gonna to have to do like pretty much a U-turn right here. There we go. Didn't work quite well, but now we're off-road in an Audi R8 V10 Plus, just remember that. I'm good. I've got a chip. That's good. Got a chip. 26 out of 100 collected now. No, over three quarter. Oh, no, over a quarter of the way done. It'll take me a while to get those chips up. This is a drift section, Nick's right here. Really is. Nice little drift section. Back over a bridge. Oh, no, I'm losing it. I'm losing it. I'm crashing. Really, I'm crashing. Everything's getting destroyed, but it's okay. We're still going. Ah, still crashing quite a lot. We've been over that bridge, I'm sure. Get some speed along here. Oh, nice little corner, this. Quite nice to drift this Audi R8 V10 Plus as well. It's not bad. I wonder if we get to keep the car afterwards. Just interested, do we? There's a chip in there. Getting rid of all these side things now. Oh, here's the finish line. And we're across the line. Event complete. 3 minutes 45. See longer than that. What I'm about. Okay. Just off that race, I got 30,000 because they decide better as well. It's quite a lot off one race. Very, very much. Challenge completed. Now for the second one. Is there only literally like three events? The next event is all the way down here. Dust off my shoulder. Oh, nah, that's a Range Rover. Range Rover Sport SVR. Insane car. Drift continuously for 306 yards. Mm. Might as well accept that because I'm only losing a little bit if I don't win. So, anyway, here we go. It's Range Rover SVR. This is a nice car, this. Very, very nice. Cannot believe this is actually a new speed payback. I'm driving a Rangey in new speed payback. Madness, that. Right, it's literally like the same event, isn't it? Pretty much, but just off-road. It's very slidey, this Range Rover. Really doesn't feel like it's got any weight to it at all. Well, and it's a Range Rover, so it's going to be heavy, but it just doesn't feel like it. I don't know why. It just doesn't. It needs to be sliding everywhere. Like, I can drift this. I can easily drift this around here. That's how light it does feel. Oh, I've got the single drift completed. I forgot about that, but i just done it. This event isn't as long as the others. Or the Audi R8 V10 Plus one we just did, so. 
Oh, what's this here? It's a cool little one thing. Bridge thing, whatever it's called. Uh, and we're jumping. We got air. We're going to get more air here. Uh, uh, yep, even more air. And there's going to be more. There is more air to get. See, these events are quite fun when there's obstacles. Well, not sort of obstacles, but jumps in them. That makes it a lot more fun. Definitely does. Not that far to go now. Oh, what's this? Through the robot. Bang, that is cool. See, that is... That's what you call a good race, this. See, even more air. There's just so much air to be got. And, and again. And again. There's going to be more air here, definitely. Not in that. And the finishes line is just up here. And that is it, guys. Across the line. Event complete. The second event. Almost two minutes. Getting 28,000 off that. You can get a lot of money off these events if you do the side bets as well. Third event to be unlocked. Yes. I wonder what car we're driving now. No, it's not got me in the rangey. I'm in my Volvo 242 DL. And we are here at the third and final event, I think it is. So if we start this, is that a Mustang? I'm not too sure. I think it was a Mustang. I swear it was a Mustang. Side bet. Drift for 1,093 yards. I might as well. That's a lot of yards. Yep, yeah, this is a Mustang. Definitely. Yes, it is. The Stang. I've right, got to do some drift in here. Is it a drift where you have to do it all in one? I don't know. No, it's not. Okay, you can do it on separate drift, which makes it easier. I was going to say that. 1,000 odd yards in one go. I'm falling off. Yeah, I can see why it's a drift. Drift challenge here as well. We do have to get to the time. See, why Why did this happen? I've just realised I've not been commentating for much of this. But we have done the total drift completed. Which is good. Got just like under one and a half miles to go. Which isn't bad. Some of these roads do get quite narrow for this. We just can't help but drift it because it's a drifting sort of Mustang. I nearly fell off there. That would have been a long fall as well. Come on, we're, we're doing this. It's going quite well. Somehow I've not actually fell off. I don't know how. Oh, this is going... There's a chip. Oh, I've missed a chip. Paul could have got that there. But obviously not. Let's keep going. We're going up. We're, de we're descending now. We're going downhill. Picking up speed. There's a chip. No, I didn't get it. I didn't even make the jump. Uh, spawn me over here now. Thank you. Mr. Chip didn't get the jump. Just didn't land it or make it, really. And the finish line is right here. And across the line yet again. Event complete. Two minutes, 36. 30,000 for that race as well. It's a lot of monies. Challenge complete. We completed the castle challenges. Series one. That's what you're saying. Daily challenge complete as well. There's a chip right here. Get that. So that, is that literally it? The Castle Challenge is done. To be fair, that was quite fun. I did really enjoy those challenges. I just wish there was more of them, like driving different cars and stuff. That was really fun. But yeah, thank you very much for watching, guys. Leave a like if you did enjoy. Subscribe if you are new around here. But until next time, guys, peace out. But I already know I'm get it.